Hey guys, Alcevin and Bamboo in. <clears throat> I, I'm gonna share with you today my other part-time job, other than being a shakuhachi player slash flute maker slash musician slash whatever. I'm also a potter's assistant, and my uh, my wife's a potter, uh, and I want to show you my job that I help her with. <laughs> So, um, today I'm going to be cleaning kiln shelves. So, we have a big kiln. It looks like that. This is our kiln for our wood kiln. And my wife specializes in wood fire slash salt fired pottery. And it's quite rare art form around these parts. Only a few people are doing it in BC. But um <clears throat> it's very labor intensive and um but the result is amazing and i'll show you a bit a little bit later on in, in the month when we have our uh, craft fair show where we'll be selling my uh my lovely lady's pottery so um but in the meantime i'm going to share with you guys my job my part-time job as a <clears throat> potter's assistant and my job is to clean these shelves there every time we have a firing which takes at least 16 to 24 hours somewhere around there um, after the kit the kiln after the firing then the shelves are really crusty and full of salty and ash and stuff and it's my job to clean them so I'm going to show you guys how to clean a shelf so Basically, I take a shovel and I put it on this table and I have my tools to clean the shelf with. I have a, a rough, well, a, a, a stone grinder thing and I have my hammer and I have my chisels. This is how it looks like. This is the process. So, dirty shelf. I'm going to proceed to clean it. And it's kind of hard on your ears, so I'm going to put on my ear muffs. Basically, I just start scrubbing. <laughs> Good to side yeah. little more 
just for a good measure of the time. My wife, Sandra, boy, boy, uh, she thinks I don't clean it enough. Some shells are more crustier than others, so this one's not bad. And I think that's good enough. So most of the general crust is off. Sides look pretty good. Back looks pretty good. And there you go. Clean shell with a fire ring coming up. So I got eight more of these to do. So. Okay, see you later.